mistake for 13,000, a lot of people have been talking about this, so let me tell you about our experience at Wolfgang Steakhouse. My sister celebrated her birthday last August and her request was for us to eat at Wolfgang Steakhouse. Itong branch na pinuntahan namin is yung sa podium and sobrang luwag niya and it's very spacious. Upon getting seated, may hinahanap akong food specifically dun sa menu but we found out that the weekend menu is different from the weekday menu but you can also ask them kasi sinaserve din naman nila, kailangan mo lang i-ask if it's available. We got served with a complimentary bread, dalawang klase siya. Yung isa is parang mas matigas yung bread. I didn't like this as much as I love this other one. Ito parang may mga herbs, may mga dahon-dahon sa loob. Masarap din naman. I also appreciate the small things like itong lalagyanan nila ng bag sa gilid so hindi mo na kailangang isipin saan mo pa ilalagay yung bag mo. Waiting time is very decent so naserve din naman kaagad yung food and this is the controversial 13,000 steak. Well, it's controversial for me because I don't go around eating steak for 13,000 pesos but anyway, this is what it looks like. I took a video from all angles para makita niyo yung kapal ng steak talaga and kung gano'n siya kalaki. And here are the other things that we ordered. We got some soup, we got some lobster mac and cheese, we got some salad, and we also got individual meal sets. Like my husband got this steak salpicao, I also got the burger, and this is the entire spread for the families. Can I just say the dining experience is just superb just because they serve everything in proper order. So I got started with the soup, nothing special, okay lang siya, and then I got started with my burger. And obviously, compared to other burgers, medyo mas mahal siya at around 800. I'm gonna be posting the exact price on here but it is really so juicy as in when you bite into it the fat almost oozes into your mouth tapos yung banya sobrang lambot din parang perfect partner sila i had my husband and everyone else on the table taste it just because it is so good tas pinatry ko rin siya sa kapatid ko pero ililoko niya ako sabi niya nasa burger machine daw <laughs> They also serve it deconstructed, meaning yung bun and yung bread lang yung magkakasama. Tapos yung mga gulay, tomatoes, onions, lettuce, nasa gilid siya. And you also have a side of chips. Oh, may kasama din pala siyang pickle. But kinakain ko na lang siya pa isa-isa. Kasi parang pag ilalagay ko pa siya dun sa burger, masyado nung malaki yung burger. This is the lobster mac and cheese. I couldn't taste the lobster. Masyado siyang cheesy, kaya ganun yung itsura ko. Hindi ako masyadong mahilig sa mga overly cheesy na bagay. Pero if ikaw mahilig ka, you will love this. And now, onto the star of the show. This is the porterhouse steak that we got. They cooked it medium rare. Tapos, kaya siya umabot ng 13,000 kasi 4488 siya per 500 grams. And may minimum siya. Kailangan mong bumili ng at least 1 kilo, which is around 10,000 na. So, nag-add lang kami ng konti because it's gonna be for the entire family. And masarap siya. It's just that at that price, I expect my brains to be blown out of my head. I mean, it's not bad. It is good. It's just that not that good that I would go back and pay this humongous amount for the steak. If there's anything I'd like to highlight though, it's just service. It's just top-notch. I couldn't complain. Here is the bill, by the way, if you guys are curious about it. That's it for today. Bye!